My company uh, design studio is called Inside Outside because um, I'm interested in both the interior space and exterior space. So we developed into a team of people who are specialized in interior design and landscape design or interior and landscape architecture. Um, and so we also here in Jolie Kerr, we are asked to look at both the gardens and the interiors and especially the communal spaces. Each building will get uh, its own identity so that it's not each block the same, but that each building, although the architecture might be similar, but the whole atmosphere and the color use and materials are for each building separately uh, and unique. What we're trying currently to do is to create a liaison between the old building and the old garden, which is actually a protected garden design, uh, create a connection to the new gardens, to the new area. To do that, in landscape, you have tools. And the tools is, of course, the climate, the planting, the path structures, you know, the necessary areas for children to play, integrating water feature, we're integrating beautiful trees. If you uh, are a tourist like me visiting Berlin, then you see uh, lots of times uh, these little natural stone inlaid uh, roads, both in parks but also in the city. The small stones are really fascinating to me because you can make mosaic with them. So uh, we, they are already used in the old garden and we want to also use them in the new gardens and to uh, organize them in a way that they really have drawings and narratives. And I'm sure in Jolique we will use also textiles or, or maybe leather or, or gold leaf or maybe wallpaper, we don't know yet, uh, as finishes for interiors and of course the natural stones for both landscape and interiors. Uh, I think green is essential. The feeling of the earth, the feeling of that you are in touch with the weather and with the sky and with the light um, and with the seasons is essential for, for mental health. Even if it's one tree, you know, it already attracts birds and insects and bees and butterflies and it sounds very um, childishly lyrical, but I, I really believe that uh, it's very important for people's minds to, to be in touch with that.